Bob Matchmaker. The Matchmaker. Er, the Matchmaker! Yeah! Okay, Jillian, I'm so glad you're here. Thanks. So why don't you tell me what kind of brought you to the really, really low place you are right now? Oh, uh, I just broke up with my boyfriend and um, we were together for four years. I just don't want to waste any time grieving the relationship. I want to get out there and I want to uh, meet... Okay, you know, let me stop you right there. First question is, is he definitely not going to take you back? No, I, I don't want him to take me back. But if he was willing to take you back... No, I don't think you understand. This was not a good relationship. And now I feel like I'm really ready to find the right partner to... Whoa, sorry. Boop. I think I'm beginning to see why I left you. Oh, he didn't leave me. Whatever. Anyway, the first problem I see is that you talk incessantly about your boyfriend. It's a huge turnoff. You asked Yeah, me. number two, you are an interrupting parrot. Uh, so, it's clear to me that you are not ready for a real relationship. So, you know what? We're gonna do this in phases. Ladies, there simply aren't that many great guys around to blow your chances on because you're moping over an ex or you're getting over a cold or something, right? You have to be operating at 100% if you want to swim in the big kid pool. Jillian has to start in the kiddie pool where everyone is peeing all over themselves and it's not a big deal. Okay, so Jillian, I am so excited for you to meet Phil, right? I think this is going to be great for you. And uh, if this goes well, you never know what it might lead to. Right, so without further ado, I would like to introduce you to my good friend, Phil. Oh my God. Are you kidding? Look at you kids to talk. He's a dummy. Okay, so Jillian, we're not gonna practice with a real human, right? Not that many guys left to blow with. So, this is to get you back into the practice of making small talk, okay? So. Be charming. Uh. <gasps> okay, so what are you doing? It seems like Phil wants to be part of the conversation, but you're clearly alienating him. I know, I know, I'm sorry, I just got really shy. Oh good, no, you see that, okay, great. That's, that's growth. Puts you with me. <laughs> You're so dirty. Okay, let's talk about your banter. So, uh, what were you just saying to Phil? Nothing. Oh no, uh, I need to know. It's my job. <laughs> no, it's private. Uh, private. Well, ask him if you're so curious. I... Uh, you know what? I'm feeling good. Yeah, I think we can move on to step two. Hmm. So, Jillian, you got the small talk down, but what if he wants to watch TV with you? Not as simple as it sounds. Like right now, what do you think he wants to watch? Football. Yeah, see, wrong cake boss. No, he wants to watch football. He told me. I don't think so. Now, I know that for some women, the hardest part about getting back into relationship is getting intimate with someone. So, pretend I'm not here. Show me your sexy self. You mean with Phil? Well, I certainly don't mean with me. That would be weird. <laughs> yeah, but are you gonna watch? Yeah. yeah, just start with some dirty talk. Um. <laughs> hey, Phil. Hey, Phil, you, you guy. Okay, wow, woof. Uh, you know what, let's double team. All right, here we go, follow my lead. Hey, you filthy little dummy. You filthy dummy, Phil. You feel us blowing on you? Oh. We're ghosts. We're sexy ghosts. We're sexy ghosts. Sexy floaty ghosts. We're floating over you, Phil. Great, see? You can use any of that stuff. Now, hey, Jillian. Look, Jillian. Jillian, do you have sexy moves? Because in the past four years, sexy moves have gotten really big. I'm gonna drop a few on you. My favorites, come on. Good, good. Okay, so my first one is karate kick booty. Ooh, koi passion. Pelvis Pac-Man. Now you go, Jillian. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Do it. Whoa. 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 That's. Hey, Phil. Where's my booty, Phil? Whoa. What? Yeah. Where's my booty, Phil? Huh? There's my butt. There's my butt. There's my butt. My 
Yeah. Okay. All right. Whoa. Good. Yeah. You are gonna get your potatoes mashed better than you ever did before. Fill me up, Belle. Fill me up. She's totally ready. <laughs> I am Paul the Matchmaker. 